We are stuck in space. We need to move boulders. We need to move the world. And, um... Right now, I don't really know a good way to do this. <laughs> well, okay, so I think Let's we should... head back to the shuttle, folks. Head back to the shuttle, folks. I'm heading back to the shuttle, folks. <clears throat> So it looks like I'm back here. Oh wait, could I have just done this the whole time? Could I have just gone to my inventory and PDA it? Oh maybe. I think Asteroid Lander is a game. It's just a mini game. <laughs> Miles, come in, Miles. Oh wait. Miles. Everything okay with the explosives, Cora? They're ready to pin the tail on Attila. <laughs> just make sure you tie them down right, Bob. Oh boy. Everything fine with the pig, Cora? <laughs> just... Looking sweet, Boston. You just... Alright, uh... I'm just Hello. going through all the combinations right now. Part all the banter. The I'm here. Give us the go-ahead on the explosives, Ken. Plant beta charge in quadrant three. Make sure you get it on a level surface so Attila blows in the right direction. You know, maybe I need to... I think, I think what I need to do is I need to go back there and then talk to them. All right, back. I wonder. This Thanks. is a little awkward that you can't just say what you need to say. Yeah. Oh, look at this. It's loading them faster. Oh. There, there's no transitionary sequences. A oh, interesting. Right where I need to plant the nuke. Huh. All right, so let's just go ahead and use every single thing we have. Wait. Army key flashlight, zero G digger. Okay, let's see. Are are you serious? Do you think Lunar Lander is just a like Lunar Lander minigame? I, I bet it is. Yeah. I think that's amazing. Right. It said amazing. that in the manual. <laughs> that's that's oh, it incredible. Did? Yeah. It's the first iPhone game. <laughs> uh, I, I want to mod this game so that it's Flappy Bird. All right, so let's let's use this right now. Let's go on our comms, Miles. Load a payload over. I read you, low. What is it? All right, I'm just gonna start Looks spamming. Like we got ah. This big old boulder right on the target side. Nice. Bam. Too big for the zero G digger. It is indeed. Oh, the digger can do it. Maybe a week. Ah, uh, let me think. What else in the pig might be helpful? What about the space? Any place where you can get leverage to use it like a pry bar? Really? No just matter a... what they all say, Cora, you're a genius. Oh, just wait, a wait. lever? You're just gonna use like a crowbar? Didn't in this I thing? tell you? Did yeah, I... you did. You oh actually... god. It's a classic leverage puzzle from the I mean, old this... school adventure game genre. <laughs> this is what you get for going to space with only four tools. <laughs> <laughs> what, what would NASA I possibly use to lever? I did not anticipate that there might be rocks on this asteroid. <laughs> Right. <laughs> There's a big rock. Where's the pig? Can Isn't I, it like, back on the previous scene? You didn't lose the pig, did you? Yeah, well, it's still up there. It's still in quadrant one. Yeah. All right, I'm going to go back to space. I'm going to go to quadrant one. Oh, my God. If we're stuck in zero G. If we're stuck in zero G. <laughs> Wait, where did that come from? Or if I we're, uh, I mean, no, right if now, we're stuck here forever. <laughs> Oh, a, oh shovel. a shovel! Oh, a shovel! Oh yeah. my god! Oh, How could you have oh you my shovel? god! I'm so, so embarrassed. Tightly packed. I love that you have like a twenty million dollar zero G digger, like two thermonuclear devices, and a shovel. And a shovel. They just were like, "Well, what if they need to dig a thing on on you know?" <laughs> this is the real. This is where the real dig begins. That's true. A, sh <laughs> a shovel. A zero, zero G lucky shovel. You bring it on every mission. How funny that a zero G shovel or a zero G digger is different than a shovel. <laughs> zero G shovel. <laughs> well, okay. It is a zero fair, G shovel. Wait, wait, to be fair, a shovel would not work well in zero G. I'm jamming the shovel in under the sure? then using maximum down thrust to pry it up. <laughs> Ooh. Does that sound workable? <laughs> Well, I'm a little short on data about the tensile strength of shovel handles in zero G under maximum thrust conditions. I hope they're flirting right now. Words, those might work. That's amazing. Be careful. If the handle breaks, maximum down thrust will smash.
smash you right into Attila. You know the saying, whether the stone hits the glass or the glass hits the stone, it ain't gonna hurt the stone. Thanks for the encouragement, kid. So let's do it, guys. There's a lot of tension <laughs> built around this shovel. That's good. Wait, isn't my defining characteristic that I'm careful? Right? Yeah. <laughs> Well, sometimes it's only the really risky oh, people. Oh! oh. Look, it's, is it gonna hit the, sh the shuttle? Now, aren't you glad I made sure the tool chest had a shovel in it? My rule is, if you can pick it up, take it with you, because you never know when you might need it. And she had exactly <laughs> four teaching us how to court. play an adventure I game. Oh to women in bars. Oh, That's shit. Scripted. If you can pick her up. <laughs> Hash, slash, slash. <laughs> Careful, kid. You don't want to find yourself getting quoted as a sexist pig in Maggie's article. Was that a hot button issue in 1995? That was like part of the. That's amazing. <laughs> By the way, I, I think like you're a spy. Banter. All right, let me. It says use shovel no, with use surface. No, use the zero G. Use the zero G. You, now that you. The box. You are already trained as an astronaut, Sean. This is I'm just going to demand things of you, Sean. Here it gonna... is. At your behest, here it comes. The target's ready for the explosive charge. No, that shovel did it. Okay. All right. All right, guys. You know, maybe they should have just brought the shovel in the first place and not even the zero jet. <laughs> yeah. Shuttle, this is low. Now placing the explosive on the base of the asteroid in quadrant three. Acknowledged. Hey, acknowledged. I need another hand here, Brent. Commander. Of course, I'm. I'm here to look. <laughs> and it appears there it is. Hey! <laughs> All right. Well, let's uh, let's get away from the asteroid. We planted the nukes. Uh, I'm gonna go to my You're inventory. Right. You're, you're zipping back and forth Zoom. between places. Borden, this is low. Do you read? Oh, do I need to arm them? Oh what god. Give us the go ahead on the Oh god. Oh, god. I'm so embarrassed. Period. 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 Low out. Period. Low out. Low out. I'm out. Now here's here's something where I'm just like, come on, because I don't. We send this home, right? Get the pig. Get the pig. Bring it home. All right, pigs. I gotta arm them first, I think. I gotta <laughs> pigs, arm. I gotta go pigs far arm. enough away. You know, let me let me do this. The arming key. Ah. Use arming key. Oh, you have an arming key. I've got Look at the pretty key. red light, boys and girls. Ooh. I'd say this charge is armed. That's terrifying. Yeah. That's a nice effect. It's actually like that's using color really, really well in that scene. Somebody who knew something about composition, art design this game. This is like... It's pretty good. It's really good. It's very... It's like so cinematically shot. Now, this, here's like, a question. This asteroid has a pair of... Stick... Right to your material, Commander. <laughs> or some <laughs> or or <laughs> Zing. How do you think that they painted these scenes at that point in time? Did they have like a Photoshop style question. program? I don't know that there was a Wacom tablet. I, yeah, I don't know the answer to that, Bill. I would guess that they do a lot of uh, like physical paintings. Come in, board. And then, them. And them then uh, pixelize them. And then like they would have pixel artists who would translate that to like. But it, you're, oh. it's, it is beautiful. And uh, it's amazing to think ball. about. You're absolutely right. Like, Come on back inside for the fireworks. Without well, I just don't. Silence. I don't know that they had scanners that were that good either. No, I don't think they did. All in, Cora. No, I think it had to be hand done. Hmm. All clear landing team. Well, maybe. Yeah. All clear shuttle. Confirm doors. All clear chat. Chat all clear. What happened to the pig? We left it there. <laughs> we Fuck the pig. <laughs> Fuck the pig. <laughs> It did its job. I no longer care about the pig. This is pretty rad, actually. This is pretty rad, although it makes me sad that uh, we don't have the shuttles anymore. 
Like, right. That's true. This was an era when we had this. That that's beautiful... really sad. I actually just remembered right. that we have retired them. The yeah. Arm. Do it. Do it. Shut up and push, Ken. My baby getting impatient. Here we go. Nice. We have Nice. Alpha and Ooh. Ooh. Nothing big coming our way. What's the pig telling us, Cora? Attila's still in one piece. Oh, they're using the pig. Guys, you beat the game. Yeah. Good job. Congratulations. Good job, guys. Everything's go for a surface walk and your option. Wait, what? Now let's go, landing team. Why are Wait, we I don't this? understand the mission like anymore. After plastic surgery. Wait, I don't, I, I don't... I don't understand. What's, what's our mission? Attila is more dangerous now than before we tamed him. Those were certainly what? profound first words to speak on Earth's new moon. Earth. That's not what taming does. Earth. I'm not making speeches, Robbins. I'm concerned about keeping everybody alive. Earth, take a drink. Commander, oh, I can oh, collect oh, rock samples later. Right now, I'd like to get below the surface down into that tunnel. We're gonna do it eventually. We might as well do it now. So, so are they just studying it? Yeah. Careful. You agree, Robbins? Careful. Yeah. Very good. <laughs> and they've created I'm a new moon. That's no moon. Remember, any rock may be loose, and any wall may collapse at any time. Please be careful, everyone. Let's Just carefully go down into the down death tunnel. We'll need the light. <laughs> He's so careful. <laughs> hey, go, pig. Down the hatch. <laughs> this is what happens when you eat. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, chat is right. We should probably save at some point. Oh, oh. Name it one. <laughs> Jesus. You see anything unusual, Brick? I think it's bigger on the inside. <laughs> Is there like no magma? The explosions open the door, but this tunnel. Old, but not as old as the asteroid. What does that mean? I don't know yet. <laughs> it just feels unnatural. Keith has an uncanny knack for uh, eyeballing things like this. It's true. <clears throat> it's a comet, not an asteroid. Right. Do you think that your name, Boston Low, is a uh, dig at Boston's Big Dig? Is that happening yet? <laughs> Odd projection. I think you're right, Brink. The stone projection is a natural. Wait, did the other guys just leave? No, they're just hanging out. The camera panned down. Look at the pig, though. It's gone into the foreground. Frank, I wish I knew what these odd projections are. Those projections feel real odd. I've taken <laughs> pictures of them for analysis. Already? When did you do that? Can you use the flashlight on them? Oh, flashlight, nice. I don't know, I don't know. It won't accomplish anything. That won't accomplish no. anything, <laughs> Sean. Sorry, sorry guys. That's as bad as when King's Quest was like, you need a skull, and there was a skull, and it was like, why would Alexander want to carry around such a heavy skull? I feel like Commander Lowe was, you know, like he, he was somehow uh, betrayed by a flashlight in the past. <laughs> That won't do anything helpful. Look at this, Brick. This can't be natural. Definitely not. Definitely not. A metal plate. Definitely an artifact. What is that? An artifact. artifact. Perfect. But who could have put something like this in a tunnel? Ha, what? Yes, yes. I think it's clear. Wherever yes. Attila came from, there was someone there. Yes. Could this be part of some kind of message? Like the one NASA put in Voyager. Yeah, oh, good it's reference. I don't understand. Voyager is still going. Whatever it is, it is. Got to tell Houston it's interstellar now. 
Yeah, invade it. I'm clapping down total security as of this moment. Just you yourself? You've got to be kidding. You've been telling me all along you just want to be an ordinary member of the mission. I've had secret orders all along to look for any sign of alien presence on this rock. Whoa! Oh, that's not secret. Now that we found it, my instructions are clear. Murder. What I want to hear from both of you right now is I understand, Commander Lowe. Oh my god, taking charge. Oh, I wow! I agree, Commander Lowe. There is nothing to be gained from a premature announcement. Robert. I understand, Commander Lowe. Ken. Ken Lowe here. I read you, boss. Tell Houston that I said Attila's a real hun. What? Is that some kind of joke? Oh. Uh. Just tell them. That um, oh, cool. this oh. is like a secret code. that implies that NASA Just thinks they could be uh, hostile. You're the only one in yeah. Congress who knows anything about this. Houston says the message is received and they're transmitting new codes. We're getting back to work down here, kid. Ooh. Low out. The like ambient sort of hollow cave no, no. sounds no, no. are really evocative. They're yeah. really good, but I don't think it's even possible with like no gravity, right? Just yeah, no and air. also no Sorry. air. Good point. Yeah, no air. There's yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. That's a great point. It's mm. Steven Spielberg. He can do whatever he wants. It's true. The plate's gone, but you've got a small shaft. Climb in it for security. Wait, what's the light small, down dark, from dark below? Opening. That's the or is pig. That just, that's the pig. The pig is foregrounded. It's yeah, it's foregrounded and shining on oh, the wall. Oh, I see. For the I see. All right, I'm gonna shine I my think light. You need, yeah. I now mean, is the time for your flashlight. It's now time to examine a small shaft. It's a small dark opening. Well, it's not gonna be so dark it's if you shine the flashlight, man. He maybe he just doesn't know how to use a flashlight. <laughs> <laughs> this isn't a pig. <laughs> it won't accomplish any. Shovel? I may be criticized for it later, but I'm gonna dig out one of these odd projections. Oh. oh. It's your decision, Commander. You know, don't listen to the <laughs> geologist or the archaeologist. I mean, if you were the first person to encounter alien life, then I think you would be criticized no matter what you did. That's true. Mm. Just there's always gonna be haters, and you need to dig out your projections. Exactly. So do you have a, a, a projection now? Am I holding a, a projection? Where did I don't understand what happened. I'm going to push another one. Oh, you're, you're pushing? You're pushing? Oh! Oh! I'm pretty sure we weren't destroying whatever message they meant us to receive. Well, so far the message is it two triangles. If they didn't mean us to push these metal plates, we wouldn't be able to push them. Mm. We'd already be dead. <laughs> <laughs> I just assume that these aliens are omniscient and omnipotent. Yeah. <laughs> Rick, I wish I knew what these odd projections are. I mean, I'm pictures of them I guess before. I'm just gonna keep digging and poking. So let me. Yes. It is, it is called the dig. <laughs> I'm gonna use the title verb uh, on these projections here. <laughs> it's another metal plate. It's, oh, I'm so disappointed. <laughs> It's yet another metal plate. I, you know, I pushed this small shaft. I pushed this small shaft. This is a really weird way to leave a message, but I'm assuming that they want us to push metal plates on small shafts. Here I go. They're a plate pushing Here's culture. Number three. <laughs> Here's number three. It seems that they like things in threes. I don't know that it disappeared so much as it just, like, retracted. It's a deep hole into the rock. This is another deep hole. Maybe this is like that. Um, this is like that uh, creepy uh, manga where there's a, a hole for each of you in the cliffside. Oh side. God, no, <laughs> no, no, no! Don't even talk about it. Into the uh, Sean, is there a fourth one, sort of on the the middle left of the screen? It's a deep hole. I see like lines. Yeah, that I mean. Look Oh yeah, there Another you go. One. Wow, what, who who does things in fours? What if there's like 15 of these? They have oh, yeah. four fingers. They're four-fingered aliens. That's right. I've heard of putting a message in a bottle, but never in a big rock. 
Okay, worse than Scott card. That was <laughs> That was that was pretty bad. That could have used a punch up. Whoa! Wow. Whoa! This one looks crazy. Maybe this is like their Mount Rushmore and they're just like triangle Splash. people. <laughs> what are you doing? Why are you pushing all over our triangles? Maybe it's just a race of babies. And this is their this is their toys. That one seems big enough to go in. Go in. You know what? I'm ready to go into a dark tunnel. Let's it's like it. an intergalactic well, change sorter. We're with you, Commander. Guys, I'm I'm here for safe. Oh. oh. Whoa. Whoa. What? Whoa. Here we go. Oh my God. We're approaching the trapezoid. Ooh. We're in a soccer ball. Whoa. This asteroid is much larger on the inside. It's a D12. Time to update you. Load a shuttle. Load a shuttle. We we rolled. There's nothing. There's seven. no static. Yeah. Of course. Should we go back outside and call them? No. No, definitely. They'll just tell NASA. I we don't want to let Mission Control know. Nah, can just tight. nah, I'm here for safety, guys, but, like, don't don't really tell anyone. Look, there's a I'm pedestal here. Let's look, just look. I'm sure nothing will go wrong and separate us from the ship. Definitely, definitely not. All right, so I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to hug the edges and see how much blue I have. I think I have exactly one thing of blue. Oh, a vent. Let me look at the vent. It's very bold that it's identified itself as a vent, as opposed to just a dark hole. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Vents? What's what's really the difference? A small vent leading back to the outer chamber. Why is it a chamber now and not just a a hole? Tunnel. It was a tunnel before. It was a tunnel, and it, it, it at one point was a hole, and it was all dark. And now there are pedestals and vents and chambers. And we blew it open with a nuclear bomb. Ooh, are those crystals? Uh, I think I'm gonna take this plate. Ooh! Oh! Now we're solving. You're gonna? Oh yes! Now we're solving. solving. Or uh, what oh are those things called? Not solutions. Um. These plates probably fit together, but how? But this on the how? There you go. Shall what are these called? What are these puzzles called? It starts with a T. Tessellations. I mean, Tangram. Tangram tessellations. Absolutely not what it is, but this must be Boom. to test whether you're an intelligent species. <laughs> yeah, this is <laughs> this was DRM back then. <laughs> they wanted... Yeah, exactly. We okay. haven't gotten into the game. So, we fit together, but how? I mean, we can infer that you're spacefaring, but are you able to solve simple geometric puzzles? <laughs> it's. <laughs> This is actually just a long-form job interview. Yeah. If a person can beat it's... the dig, then they get to work in QA. <laughs> Here we go. What? 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 Oh, that was cool. The square! It became a triangle! Ah, oh, I'm a cartoon now! Why is he pulling my shot? Oh, did we lose? Whoa! What? You guys were being careful. Are they getting readings from the pig? How's the pig? <laughs> oh my god, is the abduction wonderful for you? Whoa. Oh, shit. Whoa, did we just change shape? Yeah. We totally shape-shifted. And that's it. No more hope for a new life. Well? We're on a okay. ship. Some kind of living ship. Went through a wormhole. Of course, when Steven Spielberg originally pitched this, they didn't like the fact that they spent 45 minutes trying to plant nukes. Jesus! <laughs> well, I think we're in heaven now. The Finger Lakes of Outer Space. You must construct additional pylons! <laughs> 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 Planet-type gravity. We're not inside the asteroid anymore. 
and the pressure there's a planet there's an atmosphere take your hood off take your hat off don't do any readings just oh oh thank god here we are yes it's at least as breathable as here in la leave the suits on leave the suits on infectious agents i don't think so alien microbes should be no threat to us Yep. They have not evolved to make use of our cell structures. Uh, a yes, a great, well, well argued. Our suits won't last long mm. anyway. <coughs> I say we take them off and save the <coughs> return trip. It's if not there a bad is a idea. return trip. I'm glad you're so careful. <laughs> he protests too much. <laughs> Just like, we should take <laughs> all our clothes off for the return trip. Surprise, surprise. Attila was a spaceship all along. A starship. Faster Wait, how than do you say that without We're any in surprise in your system. voice? I mean, <laughs> no planet but Earth. Sir, don't oh, Earth? Literally the most surprising thing that has ever After happened. so many years of yeah. bad TV shows and crackpots with phony pictures. Well, you gotta remember, this was 1995, which was the height of sarcasm. Load a cockpit, over. Load a payload, over. <laughs> Load of pay. Say we're out of range. <laughs> Way out of range. <laughs> hey, we see alien life. I'll oh, PDA doesn't us. work. Uh. For all we know, it might have been a million years since these people sent out Attila, and they long since died out. What if they're not what about people? You, but I didn't pack a lunch. <laughs> or a can of pop. Well, pop. we might as well look around and learn what we can about this place. They're so not. We might be away. here a while. I know. <laughs> it's They're amazing. Just... It's amazing how like I mean every day this is. Yeah, yeah, I mean like maybe maybe Orson Scott Card thinks about this stuff all the time, so he's not really shocked to be on an alien planet, but if I were anywhere but Earth Did you hear that audio? Why are the characters not immediately saying holy fucking shit? <laughs> we flew away on a space dice to another dimension, we can't get a hold of anyone. <laughs> They're just like, well, here we are. Do you want to take your clothes off? Yep. All right. Well, let's look around. And now we're just sitting here. Yeah. And, and no one's even mentioned the alien plants either. And look, just look like, oh. I know. That's so weird. It doesn't even let me look at it. Not even the cursor doesn't care. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> huh. Wait, wait. Look, look what happens when I click on the spacesuits. Just look at this one more time. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Boston Low feels a strange pulling sensation. Robbins. Say something uh, profound. What's the... This place is as desolate as the Midwest. <laughs> yeah. Almost as desolate as the Midwest. Oh she my god. Yeah, Jesus. She's apparently from there because she said pop. And uh, yeah, so okay. that's probably her whole deal. Oh, I'm fine. This is the greatest story of my life. I the only am. trouble is, I have no way of telling it to anybody. <laughs> Thanks, Mom. Jeez. Oh. It's her. It's the greatest story of her so-called life. It's, it's the journalist's catch-22. <laughs> yeah. I have all these great ideas and no hands to tell them with. <laughs> Maggie, does Brink look okay to you? So far, he looks fine. I'm okay, Carl. <laughs> Thanks for your concern. Oh shit, we're not communicating by we radio. Have to watch out for each other. I got caught. Uh, where I just I you know I was really worried. I was worried as concerned. <laughs> I know that was weird, but it came from a good place. <laughs> what do you think about you doing so okay? Oh, I'm fine. This is the greatest story of my life. Oh, the only she's losing it. Thanks. <laughs> Talk to Brink. 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 How are you doing, Brink? Brink. Brink. You mean apart from being trapped on an alien planet with no idea of how to get back? This is a pretty desolate place. Can we all just can the attitudes? I think they are long since gone. Wait. So much dust. Undisturbed except by our own feet. There's, so there's all this dust. Nothing flies here anymore. It must be gone. The, the, the comedic wash type pilot <laughs> And the, the <laughs> congresswoman that we had sexual tension with 
they uh -huh. are now gone. Like forever. Yeah, we'll never see the, them again. The two most interesting characters. Like, rel relative, relative. Because of relativity, we're Thanks. they're probably a thousand. <laughs> <laughs> she, she already has that nomination. She's. she's <laughs> yeah. Let's go to the clearing. Where Everyone going, these though? people have known are dead. I was gonna check for water. <laughs> check for water. Or some way out of here. Out. I think we should remain together. Fine. Follow me. Horror movie rules. This Fine. is no longer a space expedition, though. This <laughs> is an archaeological dig. <laughs> da -da 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 oh. oh, sick. Fine. Fine. I get. Fine. Fine. To dig something I didn't even want to be team leader. <laughs> In the meantime, our first business is to survive. Oh, okay. He our wasn't just giving up. Our second task is to get home. <sighs> We need to work together, and I'm still the commander of this mission. Yeah, he just fa he faked. You don't know any more about surviving on an alien world than I do. Ha Boston is right, Ludger. Ludger. He's the one with experience in survival, Ludger. and we need someone in command. This is no time for a foolish power struggle. What the? Uh, all right, I agree. Did you just hear, like, alien birds? Yeah. Because did they? Today. Whoa. That's the question. Where the hell are? I mean. Oh, this is cool. How are, how are they not commenting on any of this? Yeah. Oh, the, what, what is this platform about? I guess this isn't a natural geological formation, right, Brink? Look how close the stones fit. Like ancient Peruvian masonry, so it's primitive. Maybe you should check out those about ancient breaches. Peruvian masonry, Commander Lo. Well, everyone hates us so much. <laughs> everyone hates us. Wow. So, so are they primitive? Are you calling Peruvians primitive? Fuck! Help, man! Help me out! <laughs> I'm trying to know if we're against people with guns Not or people plants, with spears, but creatures too. I'm well, not an archaeologist, but these look like bones to me. Yeah, that's the last three assholes who went inside of the uh, comet. <laughs> They're not lying where the animal died. <laughs> they were placed here. What? 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 Guys, Wait, did you not what? see the... Best Stop. Guess. Shut up! And now a home for those rat-like things. What? It's, yeah, the... What do you mean? He, he <laughs> waits for his turn in conversation and then says... Yeah, a comment about the rat light things. Again, I think holy fucking shit would be the most often said thing if I were there. Oh my yeah. god. Uh, get one. You just get like one. Sit. you can't even click on him. Can't. Yep. Robbins. Whatever. Robbins. Toto, I don't think we're in Kansas anymore. <laughs> I'm not sure that counts as profound. If profound. only I had ruby slippers. You doing <laughs> okay? Oh, I'm fine. Thanks. Yeah, she's broken. Frank. Can you make Brink. any sense of what you see here? Why is there an a animal? Archaeologist doesn't out. expect to make sense of things until he's been digging at a site for years. <sighs> we don't so we're gonna need to find food. Maybe hmm. years are all we have. Maybe years. Uh, Thanks. Too much. Yes. Go to grave. Grave. It looks like something is buried here. Yeah, not very well. Let's look at the eyes. Something's looking at me. Shovel time. Some, something was looking at me? Use shovel with grave. Always a good idea. <laughs> oh, oh man, enjoy. they're getting good. involved too. Uh oh, it's gonna come a West Side Story style grave digging! Are you just going to dig right in? <clears throat> with a shovel? You will destroy the site! Shovel? I'm not doing archaeology right now, Brink. I'm looking for something to help <laughs> there's, get us home. There's in no food. grave. Yeah. Your name will live forever. As the bone-headed space hero, we destroyed precious data at the first alien archaeological site. <laughs> you got interrupted. That's better than having my name live forever. As a dead As man. commander of an expedition that disappeared and was never heard from again. Technically, commander, your name now wouldn't... Get out of the way if you aren't going to help, Frank. <laughs> this might take a while. Without any food or any water, he's like, that's not proper archaeology. Oh, look at all those rat-like things! They seem like food, right? Yeah. 
What a fine accomplishment, Commander. <laughs> now we have a pile of meaningless dirt and bones. <laughs> this is... Maybe not. You never Good know when an alien bone will prove useful. If you know what I mean. <laughs> Sorry. It was a legally mandated joke. Uh, Alright. Uh, save? Save game? Was this the skull game? of a sentient being? Or a pet? Or a, a beast pet. of burden? I don't know, but I'm pretty sure it's dead. Oh, Jesus, everyone's so <laughs> wry. It's a strange <laughs> jawbone. The teeth still look strong. I'm just gonna take this jawbone. Yes! You have, a, have jawbone. a jawbone. I put my jawbone away. So what do you have bones. now? Like a shovel, a thermonuclear, thermonuclear device, and a java? <laughs> Whatever creature these Orange bones pants. used to be, I don't think we've got anything like it on Earth. They seem to be made entirely out of ribs. Take <laughs> it. This is light, but it feels as strong as steel. How could you know that? It's gonna be a valuable lever sometime in the future. I <laughs> know. There's gonna be a lot of leverage right. happening in this game. I can already tell. I hope you can figure some way out of this place. <laughs> I don't, I don't I'm putting you in charge. <laughs> what a Jeez. dick thing to say. In my years of studying rocks and ancient sites, I learned that sometimes the best way down is up, and sometimes the best way up is down. But not in nothing. I hope that made sense to you, because it sure didn't make any sense to me. <sighs> Thanks. Gotta get up to get down. <laughs> when in doubt, dig. <laughs> they really, I mean, to their credit, there is gratuitous digging in this game. <laughs> yeah, it was right. properly titled. Yeah. We need to make sure that the core of the game is the name of the game. Do you think we could climb this slope? Don't climb a slope. I think we could no sled. Use. It doesn't go up all the way to the top. Oh. I think so we down. Small. Are they writing or decoration? You're asking us? <laughs> Don't have a cow, man. It looks like those plants are hassling each other. This this looks like a, like mating plants right here, man. Oh, yeah. 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 Don't, don't want to click on that. Yeah, I'm just gonna go step back to the clearing. Yeah. Well, <laughs> I'm gonna go with another question mark here. <laughs> I, I just I love the sort of overall sense of despair that everyone has. Yeah, right. <laughs> sort of. <laughs> You're so much faster oh. than the other guys. This is kind of pretty, though. Is this a shipwreck? I don't know. I don't know what's happening. Fantastic. And are those plants, or are they tiny little alien skeletons? Like oh. scarecrow. Oh. Oh. Do you think there's XCOM or anything? Oh! Online? It seems someone had to have been here. Early life. Let's hope they're peaceful. Early life. Or gone. Peaceful or gone. It does seem like someone had to have been there. There's a spaceship. <laughs> it's a small I... sign. Wow. Should we look at the spaceship? Yeah, look at the spaceship. I think we're gonna look at the spaceship. This can be interpreted as evidence of life. <laughs> I get the sensation that someone didn't grow this. <laughs> this alien technology is hopelessly wrong. You don't. You've never seen it. You don't know it. They're just really good at eyeballing stuff. They just. They have great intuition. <laughs> I see some like cues. About what these people look like from the interior of their ship. What? Think about the things Always you say. <laughs> Corrosion. Perhaps animals have moved things around. What? Hard to know what I'm looking at. Oh, I see. Those were not related. Let me look. Try not to disturb anything. Now let me just drink. Just stand there. Let me. Let me briefly. Save again. There's a rasping crackliness in the audio, and I'm sorry. I'll try to fix it during the Never next mind. break. Never mind. Let's look at this chest. Well, I don't see any treasure, but there is something in here. A device. When we get it's back, it's clearly not gonna treasure. Field day, trying to figure out how this worked. All right, I'm actually gonna fix this audio problem right away. 
All right. Oh. All right, guys. Here, wish me luck. This is this is going to be a big risk. I'm going to take Good it. Much. I'm going to disable all the audio and I'm going to re-enable all the audio. Here it comes. No clickety clacking in. Put it in. All right, here we go. We're going back to the dig. Play. Nice. Let's give it to Brink. Alien technology and conveniently portable. Alien PDAs. We just still have a pitter patter in the audio, but I think that's just that's that's part. I think of the that's game. the game. Yeah. That's just the bugs and the some code. kind of device. I have no clue what it might be for. I mean, it looks like an icon or what? What the hell? It, I mean, it looks like a compass. Does it? it, it to me, it looks kind of like a bubble with a like a bubble with a little triangle in it. Yeah, it it's it's like a a bubble holding an element of Space Invaders, kind of like those little things you get in the yeah. desert where they have like a gel yeah. with a scorpion inside of it. Yeah, exactly. This yeah. is just gel with a shape inside it. It's really cool. I know. I, just, I do wish that they'd describe it a little better because it's an alien yeah. yo-yo with a triangle inside. Hangs inside a small chest. Very 90s. Yeah. We might need this wire later. <laughs> I'm gonna see if I can pull it down. <sighs> Good idea, Commander. Shouldn't you turn the power off of the breaker box? Wait. What? Just. That was a joke, Lo. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh. No. Yeah. Okay. I was gonna say. Oh, sure. Stand just try to be Jesus. safe about it. Down on our yeah. Be just careful. be careful. Be careful, Boston. Be careful about this now. But you're right. You should but just grab that one with your wire. Hands. <laughs> just there. You go. Good job. Ah! Whoa! What? Whoa! What the hell? Um, it's a dragon. Look at it. It's beautiful. How are you that nonchalant? What the hell just happened? What? Changing shapes. Mathematical progressions of ever more complex polyhedrons. Uh, Next he's time, I suggest pulling a wire. No, no, I'm glad you did. <coughs> Don't get me wrong. <laughs> Not a random electrical discharge. I like reclips in chat. Maybe it's a kind of computer display. The space goes. <laughs> piloted this ship, it conveyed some meaningful information, but to me, it means yeah. It's a computer nothing. that you uh, you interface with it by pulling wires out of the ceiling. <laughs> <laughs> Gee, Jesus Christ, Captain! Good thing you thought of that. Yeah, right. Like, I love the engineer. He's like, look, when people need to know information, they're only gonna know one time. So that's why you pull the cord completely out. And then when it's on the ground, they know something. So you can always know how much was learned by staring at the it floor. It still might be useful. It's still. I really have a lot of faith in this wire. Maybe it has more ghosts inside it. This is engraved rod. Did any of you see? Was this here before that thing appeared? No. Of course it was. Do you think an electrical field can carry a solid object? Really? Jeez, Commander. Jeez, Commander. By the way, Wait. bacteria won't be a problem here, and don't dig anything, and I don't know what the bones are. Yeah, what did you get? What is that? Uh, it looks like a, looks like a charm bracelet. Engraved it's a rod. Engraved. Five geometric shapes. Pro progressively kind of more complex polyhedrons. I have no clue what it might be for. <laughs> oh, it's clearly not a randomly discharged rod. <laughs> this wire isn't metal. A transparent fiber cable. Silicone, probably. I'm betting it carried data. Sure, it's Fios. It's a... Uh, this is, uh, you know... <laughs> This Google wasn't... Fiber actually came out here before they got to your town. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> this is not a pre-Comcast spaceship. Um, I'm moving my mouse around to see if there's anything that turns blue. Let's talk to them and see their, their wry, nasty comments about the amazing miracle we just witnessed. Brink. All right. I don't know if I set that off by pulling the wire or if it was just coincidence. Just keep pulling everything you see and we'll find out, Lo. What a bastard. <laughs> Do you think that was an attempt to communicate with us? Was your pulling the wire an attempt to communicate with them? Did it ever occur to you that maybe if they wanted to communicate with us, they'd just come up and talk? 
Brink, how does Maggie seem to be holding up? She seems to be fine, Commander. She's right I'm there. Okay. Yeah. We all see. have to watch out for each other. And talk about each other. <laughs> In front of each other. <laughs> right there Strange we go. Strange lights. What was that apparition? <clears throat> ah. So Ugh. much to learn and not a single piece of instrumentation. No. All right, goodbye. Thanks. Let's talk to Robin, Robin. and then I have one idea. Do you think we just set off an alarm? Right now, I'd be glad to see some spaceport police come and arrest us. I've never Probably felt anything food. like that. It was as if I were inside a magnet. I'm still tingling. Oh. Could it... Do you think it could have been alive? Oh. Who knows what life really is? <laughs> but it sure was an organic life. <laughs> Amazing. Oh. Maggie, does Brink look, does okay Brink look like an asshole to you? So far, he looks fine. Stop trying to set hey, them up. Amanda, thanks for your concern. <laughs> Stop. Stop. We all have to watch out for each other. He goes to Brink. He's like, "How do you think she's doing, huh?" And she's like, "I'm fine." And you're like, "Okay." Walk over to Maggie. How do you think Brink's doing, Maggie? Huh? <laughs> Do you think it was trying to get one of us hurt? I don't know, but apparition seems like a good word for it. All right, here's the one thing I want to try before Thanks. break. I want to use this thing. It's indicating what? to the right. What the? F what? I told you it was a compass. Didn't I say compass? Oh I my god, I'm so good at alien technology. Oh my god, you, are you a interstellar archaeologist? I are am. you are you a That's... biophysicist? <laughs> Bioastrologist? Wait, can I use this thing with the device? I can't use these two things together. You can't. Not in town. But I think you can go to the right. I want to use it. It's indicating it's to indicating the right. To the left of me. To 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 the left. It's so bad for them to say to the left, to the right, because he's facing us, so we go in the opposite direction of it. But look, we've been going for 40 minutes, and when we return, we're going to find out where the compass points. Here on Mostly Walking, our second title, The Dig. We'll be back yeah. in a sec. Yes.